Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials trading down 101, Nasdaq's down 110, S&P's off 20. Gold, gold contract down $18.60 at $17.81 an ounce. We have silver down 26 cents, $19.94 an ounce. A late sweet crude up a buck 30 at 87.90. Notes and bonds. You get the 10 year note down 19 ticks, trading 118.25. The 30 year off 29 at 140.10 in King Dollar. King Dollar right now is trading up 83 ticks, 106. 583, the euro is at 101, the yen is at 135, and the British pound is at 120 to 1 US dollar. We get over and take a look at the market, folks. We had the Fed minutes come out. When we did have the Fed minutes come out, bottom line is that the market did a 0.618 retracement from the highs of yesterday. Now, let me show you something here, though. This is weak. My take, we're going to go right back down to downtown before the close. Let me show you something. So, in the SPY, it was trying to fill the gap. The gap in the SPY. Is uh, 429.55. Well, the the spy went to 429.50. Did, didn't fill it. And when you don't fill a gap, and you've been basically you're down, you're trying to get back up. That is weakness, particularly so. The Qs got a long way away from the gap, actually, where the spies almost hit it. So on the Qs, the gap there was 332.28. Well, we hit 331.43. That says quite a bit. This has been able to at least fill the gap. You can see when the minutes come out, the first bar is a powerful bar. No doubt about that. We had volume. We had price. That being said, you're back inside the bar now, which we shouldn't be back inside the bar also. So the bulls and bears are going to be fighting this out coming into the close in a monster way. King Dollar. Let's go take a look at King Dollar because this baby is still laying right at its benchmark. And... The benchmark that we're talking about here, as you bring this over, it's the high that the day of strength, and that number is 106.792. We hit 106.890, didn't hold price. Yesterday, we also hit 106.943, didn't hold price. So I suspect in the longer frame, folks, it looks like to me that this is going to have a hard time holding price. And if that's the case, bottom line, you know, it should get lower and if it does get lower i'm not talking about today then you know the bottom line is that the market would be able to basically get some strength my take right now though is it's going to be more selling pressure coming into the close stay right there folks come right back